Hi, I'm Mark Rich, and we are coming to you from our nation's capital. It may have taken us 22 years, but tonight, 22 minutes, is in Ottawa. And like many first-time visitors, we're taking the tour. And what better tour guide to have than NDP MP Peter Stauffer? Trudeau said no. Thank you, Peter. Well, Mark, thank you very much for coming. Now, sir, tell us a little bit about where we are. Well, one of the foyers of the House of Commons, this is the entrance where all the members of Parliament would come in. And right now, though, you're surrounded by what is called Manitoba limestone. It was this stone after Peter, the I'm going to stop you there. I'm just realizing now that this is far too boring a segment to start a show with. I'm just going to go to the theatre. Hey, Mark, before you go, though, I wanted to show you the two portraits of our first two Prime Ministers, Sir John A. Macdonald and Wilfrid Laurier. They're just over here. They're actually beautiful portraits along with other Prime Ministers. Mark? 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 Oh, God. And I thought Tom Mulcair was boring. Hey, what's going on here? You can't just march into the office of the leader of Her Majesty's loyal opposition. What's up, Craig? Tom, I'm really sorry. I just... Stauffer was giving me a tour and he was boring me to death. Tour? Why didn't you say so? If you want a tour, I'll start with the frescoes. These are the only frescoes in the House of Commons. They're all done by Tilio Pustella, the Italian artist. That one's called Reconciliation. And they're all themed to the opposition. This guy over here is watchfulness. Now, over here, there's a really nice one. If you look behind the right knee of the one who's on the ground, Mark, Mark. Why does this keep happening to me? The show's about to start. I'm going to be late. Good, 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 good. Oh, man. Oh, good. I'm gonna make it. Hey, Mark. Ah! Tony Clement, hey. It's good to see you. Are you here to interview me? Uh, uh nobody. Look, uh, we're doing a live show, and I'm in a bit of a hurry, so I can't. Oh. <laughs> well, listen, now that we're here, I can tell you about this great segment I have for you involving the National Apathon. It's called Code. You can register on open.canada.ca. It involves 200,000 open data sets from the federal government and all these coders. It'll be a great show. I'm telling you, it'll be wonderful. Look, this is my stop. I've really got to go. Sorry, Tony. No! Tony, no! Tony, no. let me go! All right. I'm going to make it. Hey, look! It's media! You want a pamphlet? Oh, no. Liberals. Wait, have you heard the latest, greatest news about Justin? He's got what he takes! Have you heard the book? Wait, have you heard the, the latest, great news about Justin? Have you heard? Peter McKay? Hey, Mark, what's Whoa. going on? Liberals. Hop in. Go, go, go! So what's going on? What are you doing? Oh, we've got this great live show tonight here in Ottawa. But I'm running late, you know, and it's good because there's really some great material because, you know, we're doing a lot of conservative jokes, stuff about Harper's haircut, a Muslim scientist. Oh, the CSIS powers you had, just throwing Canadians in jail willy-nilly. Oh, <laughs> beard shag off on you guys. You guys are totally screwed now, right? That's it. Get out. Oh. Is this it? Oh, cool. Thanks, buddy. You know, I used to make fun of you a lot, Peter, but you're not right guy. Get lost, Critch. Come back! Bonjour! What the son of a-